In this tutorial, we're going to look at arming and disarming a queue in QLab. When you import audio into QLab, it will automatically be armed, therefore ready to go. If you get to a point where you have a certain queue that you're not sure you want to use, but you don't want to fully delete from your queue list, then disarming it is a good way to go. In your basics tab, you can arm and disarm a queue by simply clicking on and off on the armed. When you click off, you will see that your queue then becomes hashed and you can't activate or trigger your queue. It will just do nothing. You can rearm and then your queue will trigger as normal. You can also add an arm or a disarm queue into your queue list by clicking on the icons in the toolbar. Here we've added a disarm queue as with other queues, we have a red cross, meaning there is no target queue. So we need to tell it the queue we want to disarm. So we can drag and drop the queue we want to disarm onto that queue. And when we play the queue, it will trigger as normal. And when we disarm, it won't do anything to the queue whilst it's playing, but it will then stop us from being able to trigger the queue in the future. So if we now click disarm, you will see the queue has been disarmed, but it has continued to play. Once we stop the queue, it remains disarmed until we rearm it. So now, if we try and trigger the queue, nothing will happen.